Uh, let me see what Tony was saying. Off topic, but that's like a time when I told one of my friends that I'm going to become entrepreneurs, man, worth myself, and then I was like, it's impossible to do so. This, this, this is what I mean, fam. This is what I mean, fam. Yeah, every every now and then, yeah, I get some. This is called red tape shit. Yeah, one of my work colleagues, shout out man like the wing. Yeah, one of my work colleagues, actually, he's a frolic. Yeah, that's a colleague who man's converted him into a friend. Yeah, he's actually a he's actually got mutual cousins with me, so we're related to the same people. But him and I are not related. But yeah, it, it, that's my brother in it, man like the wing. In it, you know who you are fam. My man called me up. Now he's an electrician. I worked with him. We done our apprenticeships together. He's called me up, and he now and then he calls me up to talk about electrical stuff or whatever in it. Yeah, and he called me up. So I thought he was calling me up to talk about some electrical stuff. He called me up to talk about um, uh, property or whatever in it. Now he wants to do fixer uppers, right? He didn't really know the term for in it. He basically wants to get into property renovation yeah he wants to buy properties fix them up and possibly live in it for a little while and then sell it whatever in it he wants to buy properties and fix them up yeah and he's basically saying that he don't know on it yeah now this is one thing though yeah which is true yeah and it's unfortunate a lot of us in the black community don't know about stuff to do with properties and that yeah, like my parents did not teach me nothing about buying a property. They still can't teach you nothing about buying a property because they don't own no properties themselves, isn't it? Yeah? Now I'm not saying everyone in my family is like that, yeah. But in the black community, a lot of us don't know about stuff, innit? So he said, bro, he's just running out of people to talk to. So he phoned me up, whatever. Innit? I'm younger than him by like 10 years. But it's not about age, innit? It's not about age. Just because you're older don't mean you're older, you know. And just because you're younger don't mean you're dumb, don't mean you don't know. Yeah, there's certain men who are young but they know a lot and certain men who are old and don't know nothing yeah so it's not all about it so he called me up and i said to him bro like it's not that difficult you know you just need to go to auction houses or just look for properties that are ran down or whatever in it yeah and he was just asking me questions here and there or whatever in there without getting too much details in it and he said to me distinctively and this is where i got that term from red tape obviously i heard about red tape before in it but he said all the people them that he knows in his circles and that, they've told him, oh, oh, you don't want to get involved in property, man, and renovations and that is difficult and there are bare red tape, you have to jump through all these hoops. And I'm like, who the fuck are these people, fam? Why are they trying to discourage our next man? Like, like this stuff is not hard, fam. But man are still trying to discourage people. It's because they're not doing it themselves. There's people in this world, right? They don't want to see anyone advance past them. Like I said before, you don't know who your friends are until you are doing better than them, yeah? Yeah, you earn 30, he earns 35, and he earns 32 grand a year, yeah? He drives a BM, you drive a Mercedes, he drives a Audi, all on the same level, yeah? We all live in terraced houses or whatever, innit, yeah? We're all on the same level, yeah? Let one of them man there drive, start driving their Bentley. Let one of them, the same man who's driving their Bentley, Drive a um, live in a fucking mansion, yeah, and be going out and a girl that looks like fucking Lori Harvey, or whatever. Innit, yeah? You see how them other two men start treating him. Ah, oh, he thinks he's better than man or whatever. Innit? Yeah, when you want to step out of your comfort zone and start doing great things, you see the people them around you start to hate on you. Yeah, like man's electrician or whatever. There's a thing called the NIC EIC. It's similar to gas safe where the gas engineers are registered underneath a specific body, but it's for the electricians, yeah? I know a man who's called me up to ask for advice, and he said to me, blood, like, you're like the only person who said to go for it, because he said to me, is it difficult? I said, yeah, it is a bit difficult, but don't let that stop you, yeah? You need to be on point, though, but don't let that stop you. I've achieved it. I've got my NIC, EIC accreditation. I had to work for it. I had to do jobs for free, but... It's, it's nothing impossible to achieve. And he's like, yeah, man, everyone's asked, everyone else that I spoke to is saying, oh, how, how hard it is, how difficult it is. Listen, you see in life, you see these people around us, yeah? You tell someone about some idea that you've got, yeah? Whether it's fucking starting your own recipe, buying and selling cars, um, uh, fucking buying property and fixing them up, yeah? 
As soon as you come to someone with an idea, the first thing they're going to tell you is about how wrong it's going to go. All the negatives, that's the first thing they're going to tell you. All the negatives about your plan. First thing. They're not going to say to you, you know what, that sounds like a good fucking idea, right? The first thing they're going to say to you is about all the negatives, everything that can go wrong with this idea. When I first, before I jumped on YouTube, yeah, I guarantee you 95 million percent, 95% of the people that are around me will say, don't get on YouTube, don't get on YouTube. Now, I ain't made it far on YouTube, but let's say yeah, in a year's time, I'm out on stage doing speeches and motivational speaking and that, right? Imagine when I get to that level, yeah? People will be like, oh, yeah, man. Yeah, you really made it. You really made something of yourself or whatever, innit? Yeah? Those would be the same people I'm telling you beforehand, yeah? If I talk about, yeah, I'm going to go on YouTube. I'm going to talk about controversial topics and I'm going to swear in my videos. I'm going to talk about this. I'm going to talk about times where man's been in this gang and doing this and doing this and doing that or whatever, innit? They'll say, oh, no, don't go on YouTube. Don't. Don't. They'll talk about all the negatives. Oh, no, people will look at you this way. I don't give a fuck. 